Okay, welcome back to my channel and let's get right into it. Uh, once you have your front curls styled and the back of your hair pinned up, um, you'll want to take a bandana and uh, fold it under a little bit like so. And then turn it around and put it at the back, at the nape of your neck, covering your hair. And then bring it up like so. Pull that corner forward a little and catch it. And gently Tie this down, making sure your curls are visible up, your front curls are visible up front. There. And what I like to do is to take this corner and just pull it back and then take the ties and do my standard tie. And that way, once I tuck everything, I'll show you what I do with it. Okay. Bobby pins. Then you gotta bobby pin this in place. My bobby pins. Where are my bobby pins? My bobby pins. Where did they go? Ah, right in front of me. <laughs> Isn't that just typical of me? Okay. And then two, I like to put them, I'll show you, right here. And then the last two tucked right here to hold the top of the bandana in place. place to hook it and catch it like a standard tied bandana okay. and then one on the other other side just just to be more secure okay and then I take this and tuck it underneath just like so and then I fluff up these so that they look kind of like petals. That's the other reason I call this the rosy. I get called rosy when I'm out in town, regardless of how I wear the bandana, especially if it's red. But uh, this one is actually how uh, Rosie's hair was, Rosie the Riveter's hair was uh, tied up um, in that uh, iconic poster in the 1940s. Okay, and you can spray it with hairspray just for a little added staying power, that flower, and it'll work on the cotton fabrics. Fluff up your curls. Okay. And there you have it. And it's very, very simple. And it's usually something I do when my back curls have lost a little bit or all of their curl. So there you go. I had to pick up my cleaning and a few other errands. Um, but one of the things I really like about uh, putting a bandana in my hair is that it makes everybody smile, um, which is a great, a great thing for my mental health. I, I, I like to peop see people smile at me. Even the young guy at the donut shop smiled at me. Had to pick up some donuts. I'm not in town very often and I probably had too many, but they're real donuts.
Can't beat a real dog. Then before heading home, I thought I'd drop in and surprise my husband. One more time. Thanks for joining me and for watching till the end. And if you like this video, please hit the like button. And uh, if you like this sort of content, then please feel free to subscribe to my channel. I upload as often as I can. Yeah. Um, oh, there was something else I was going to say. Oh, and if you like to see updates on the videos I'm making um, or random pictures of my chihuahuas and mountain life, um, then uh, follow me on Instagram. I, I post there more often than I upload here. So have a great day or night wherever you are and bye now. Then uh, follow me on Instagram. Um, if not, don't follow me. I, I, I'm sure I will get over it. And uh, blah, 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 blah. What else? What else? What did I just say and what have I said so far? I really need a script for these these endings. Even as many of them as many of them as I have done. I, I still need like a, an outline at least. Hmm.